Hello, I'm here to tell you about Pianoscope and how to set up a new tuning. So I'm just doing the screen record. Pianoscope and we will put, call it video. Not to confuse it with other things and it's a Beckstein and it's model nine and I won't put the serial number in. I'm going to change the tuning style to what I call bass, which is slightly stretched bass, just a few cents at the bottom. And then I'm going to make it 441 because the piano is very sharp. And then it's a seven octave piano. So we put the top note at A7 and we are ready to create a new style. When we play all the notes up to C7 and measure them. Measure. Uh, you can do fine tuning, which is every note, or you can do coarse tuning, which is the grade notes, but we're going to do a fine tuning. Right. Right, so that's measured, but I'm going to try one of these again because it's way down that one. This piano doesn't have very good bass strings. So we'll try to see again and see if it changes. Got very poor bass strings this piano, but it still tunes okay. So now we've got um, all the inharmonicity is measured, and now we, I'll just show you how to tune a few notes. I'm not going to do it, tune the whole piano at this point. You start at the bottom. You see, it's very sharp. So my next one. I will do a pitch lower as opposed to a pitch raise, but I'll just tune a couple of, tune this C. Okay, in the next one, I'm going to show how to do a pitch raise, although in this case it's a pitch lower because the piano is very sharp and I want to get it down to 441. So you push that, pitch raise, and you have to put some things in about the piano. Highest bass bridge note, highest wound string note. 
First treble strut. Second treble strut. Continue. Wound string limit, that's safe for this piano, and so is that. No adjustment, as far as I know. Use existing measurement, because I've just seen. And then it wants a few extra notes for the pitch raise, so we do that one and the A. Right, and then we're done. So now you can start at the bottom and is below the zero, and that's doing the over pull or under pull, as the case may be. to do them all as you go up, but I'm going to skip for brevity and we'll go to the break.
So that's enough of that. You know the idea. And then when you're done with the pitch raise, a little lower, you end, and it goes back to the normal screen. And when you go over it again, it's pretty much there. It won't take you too long to do the whole tuning again, and it'll be quite good. Just a bit more on the display of the piano scope, which I like very much. You try to get the squares slow. Sometimes in that part, you need to put chromatic up and down so it doesn't jump octaves. There you go. That's and it's logarithmic, so the that's what I'm talking now. The, lo the last one cent is very fine indeed.